Right, so we're going to jump into Gladius for the first time, see how it, see what it's all about. I'm intrigued. Gladius Prime was a bastion of humanity, newly colonized. A suitable base for our chapter to rebuild and recruit. We space marines raised our fortress here. Grew strong again. But the orc invasion brought a warp storm that cut off our Emperor's light. And the dread Necrons crawled from the earth beneath our feet. War was on all sides, yet we are the Emperor's chosen. We do not dread the dark, or quail at the relics of old. Terror is for those who oppose us. We know no fear. All right, so here we are. Welcome to Gladius. So it's just be about moving the camera at the point. Space Marines only have one city. Take your time to explore the interface. It's almost like they're not going to help you with the interface. You're going to have to figure this out by the look of it. Um, makes things a bit interesting, but can't be too complicated. They're just going to leave you to it. So anyway, here we are. Let's just see which ones do. Oh, well, I've got to use the arrow keys rather than what we're used to. So it moves in and out pretty effortless. The HUD here, it does, obviously it must be the um, the way Warhammer is then, because obviously other Warhammer games, it looks very similar, the font and everything, like Total War, Warhammer, that's good. But what I'm excited about is obviously it's like Civilization games, and but with Warhammer, there's a lot of diplomacy and whatnot to go in there before you get into fights, and I just like the fact that you're on a... A map and pretty much in it immediately. It's quite quick, isn't it? It moves quick. So let's move on a unit. Move the unit by pressing the right. Well, that's obvious. Each unit can only be moved once per turn. But we don't really know where we're heading towards. But this looks like it could be something. It does say it's an outpost, so I'm guessing you can only move within the green range. Um. Why did I move that one there? Oh, uh, well, let's get a move in. Let's get a move in. So we've got a little achievement for that. Planting the flag. So we've obviously got an outpost. Good news. We can't be really moving any further, I don't think. Nope. Let's move Oh, so it does, it, it constructs the outpost automatically by the look of it. We go here now. So there's an enemy faction there, look, two of. We're going to need backups. They engage, we're going to be a bit screwed, I mean. There are ruins of Vol in sight. These ruins provide rewards to the first player exploring them. Right, I think we're going to be a bit screwed at the moment. I don't think we'll go back. No, nah, we're going to have to... What we've got here then, so we've got Overwatch passive action. We've got a hold position. Let's hold. Just do defence. Just do defence. We've got a research tree by the look of it. Tier 1. Armoury, frag grenade, orbital scan. I kind of think they're frag grenade, but building that produces ground vehicles as well as... Do armoury first, shall we? So, we're holding our ground. Oh, thankfully they've backed off. So where it's saying execute queued order, it's obviously where I've clicked that one and said right clicks. So it's saying do you want to execute that? But 
Pues say, I need to get. If we get them there. I don't want to go further than they can reach too much, really, because we need to be able to back each other up. Oh, wow, look. We've got like, a gateway. Right, every unit has a variety of statistics and attributes, traits, abilities, and weapons, each with their own ranges and effects. Um, move your mouse over the icons and buttons in the selection panel. Just all this, isn't it? Attacks enemy units that enter their attack range. Yeah, let's do that. Well, we can't do anything else. Well, that's an outpost. Wouldn't it be better to hide in there? Right, so I think it's saying we should be building an army before we attack. And here we are. Terrain affects units in a variety of ways. Forests and Imperial Ruins. Increased movement. Blah, blah, blah. Um... What stats does it tell us then? We've got 6 armor, 15 hit points, 4 morale. I'm not really going to worry about all that because I don't kind of live worry about anything. So 6 and 15, we've got 8 and 15. Um, yeah, we're, we're considerably stronger. Now their turn, I guess. Here we go. <laughs> oh, wow. So it does take quite a few hits here. I ain't just sort of like one hit wonder. Oh wow, what are these monstrosities? Crikey, look, they're hit points. Ooh, they're, they're behemoths. Wow, look, 36. We've only got 15, they can take a, a walloping. Where's their attack strength? Morale... Doesn't mean, don't get it. I don't get that part. Um, it's just saying I want to take part in. Or can we, we heal? How do you heal? Here. Yeah, old position. Do the same, dude. Do the same. I'm guessing we want to take that gateway. So it's telling me about a little compendium. I think it's like a Wikipedia of the um, sort of the rules, engagement, and whatnot. Right. We're well, gonna have to wait. Although he's full, isn't he? He's all right. Let's see what he can do. Oh, this. What's this? They're protecting that. Right, we're not going to wait. We need to get moving. Can we not take that? You know what? I might just go for it. I feel a bit nutty. <laughs> Come on, dudes. We must not meddle. Me lord. <laughs> we meddle. We meddle. Please tell me they can't shoot from there. Yeah, we've got something. Blood skull altar provided blood blessing. Don't know what that means, but it can only be good. And we're nearly there. Shoot them, peeps. Are too far? Got rid of one of them. I don't think they've got much attack. I think they're more like 
They can just t absorb a lot of um, at attacks. What does that do? Got achievement for it. Invulnerable. Siren Caster. What does that do then? Increases the loyalty of your cities. So we need a city. Is this a city? That ain't a city. How do we plant a city? Oh, we can only have one. Um, center, wasn't it? Was it this bit? What's this? I did say it at the start, didn't I? They can only have one um, main hub. Let's go now like these. Oh wow, look, a swarm. They've got no attack. Oh, we're coming. Oh, I didn't mean to remove them. Oh, cheeky. Just zoom across the river. Uh, where do we go from here? If that's a defense place, let's see. That weren't good. Oh, they are cheeky. <laughs> they are a bit, bit naughty. Right. I can't fight them with just two enemies, and I'm not sure I have like two units. Just scattering us, aren't they? Right, let's go back here again. Just bloody flanking every time. I think we might have some research to do so. We've had a few turns here. This unit's going to get wiped out, I think. Got a problem. They're going to nick that. No, they're not. Right, we need to gather this. Get them in there. Let's get in there. What's blood blessing anyway? I'm wondering... Let's move them out of there and put them in there. Maybe they'll heal better there. Oh, 
Oh my lord. Oh my lord, what's that? I didn't think they could attack. Maybe this is how to lose. This ain't looking good. Your enemy has been taken over. Oh, well, God. Wait a minute. Your unit has been taken over by enslavers. Kill the enslaver to release the troops from their grasp. Who's the enslaver? Is it them? I think we're back. No, we're not. Oh, no, no. That is naughty. I don't know who the enslaver is. Holy crying out loud. I don't want to kill my own teammates. <laughs> How do you kill an enslaver if we don't know who the enslaver is? This ain't going well. Uh. He's dead. I think we lost. This is a bit weird. I've got no units left. All I've got is this bleeding ass thing. And it's letting me continue. Don't know. Uh, maybe that's what they had to do. I don't know. Is this, which is a very odd thing to be, uh, find myself in. All right, finally, well, we lost. <laughs> All right. I have a funny feeling you weren't supposed to win. With just two units, what options was there really? I just said on the easiest difficulty. <laughs> oh mate, I don't know if I'm supposed to do well there or not. Be interesting to find out. But I mean, I'm gonna lose. I'm gonna lose some time to this because I quite like it. It's quick, isn't it? It's just quick gameplay. I like that. Because Total War, as much as it, as good as it is, it's quite, it's a very slow pace to get to where you're going. And I quite like this.